Competition. Merriam-Webster defines competition as a contest between rivals. Rivals, defined as one or two or more striving to reach or obtain something that only one can possess. As a people, competition and rivalry has long served as a motivating challenge for its participants and an emotional roller coaster for its audience. No matter what size of venue, to the audience and the participants, competition sparks greatness, hope, and letdown in us all. Western Slope fifth graders took to the stage in February to face off in the age-old art of competition. This for the right to represent their school in the state spelling bee competition. The top eight would be given an invitation to the state meet. The blustery cold day outside could do nothing to cool spirits inside the Mount Garfield Middle School gym. Expectations were high and the gym was filled with an electric anticipation. Parents patiently waited for their child to be called to the stage. Participants doing anything to dissipate the anxiety many felt in their gut. And then it was time. Students were called out by number and one by one the competitors arrived, filling the auditorium tables to receive instruction on how the competition would be run. Next, it was taking their place on the stage. Parents were invited in. The microphones were hot. The judges ready. And then the competition began. Coffee. C-O-F-F-E-E. -E. Coffee. One by one, fifth graders worked through the words, relying on their mental preparation and recalling the lessons in phonetics that had prepared them for this moment. Indelible. I-N-D-E-L-A-B-L-E. A single bell rings out, cutting through the silence of the room. The ring, denoting that for this student, this competition has come to an abrupt halt. And slowly the stage empties. Words become more difficult, demanding a deeper level of concentration and mental visualization. Now, only eight students remain, their tickets punched to the upcoming state competition. But reaching state is only part of the goal for these well-prepared students. First place remains on the line. More bells ring out from the judges' table. More students filter down from the stage and rejoin their parents and peers in the audience. Until there were only two remaining. Vestige. V-E-S-T-A-G-E, -E, Vestige. And then, one. With confidence, a final word is heard. Foosball. Processed, and its letters are repeated one after another. Foosball, F-O-O-S-B-A-L-L, -L, Foosball. The letters fall into place, and this competition has come to an end. A champion has been crowned. And the audience applauds the great victory. With the District 51 communications team, I'm Ryan T. Cook.